This is the Trump Breaking News Network. Here's what's happening. WikiLeaks offers $20,000 reward for information on Obama officials destroying documents. By Charles Campbell. WikiLeaks is offering a $20,000 reward to anyone who catches anyone from the outgoing Obama administration of destroying important public records. The whistleblowing website sent out a tweet Tuesday night briefly detailing the situation. Twelve minutes earlier, WikiLeaks urged system administrators in the Obama administration to pass along important information. The messages might have been provoked by a previous post suggesting the U.S. government is secretly removing mentions of the organization from official statements. The tweets occurred the same night Fox News aired host Sean Hannity's interview with WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange. The two discussed allegations that Russia was behind the hacking that led to WikiLeaks' publication of emails from a private Democratic National Convention server. We can say, we have said, repeatedly over the last two months, that our source is not the Russian government and it is not a state party, Assange told Hannity. WikiLeaks managed to publish more than 50,000 emails from John Podesta, former chairman of Hillary Clinton's campaign during the run-up to last year's presidential election. President-elect Donald Trump noted in a tweet Wednesday that Assange denied Russia's involvement in the DNC hacking. He also echoed Assange's remark that Podesta was so careless that a 14-year-old could have hacked his emails. Podesta gave out that his password was the word password. His own staff said this email that you've received, this is totally legitimate. So, this is something. A 14-year-old kid could have hacked Podesta that way, Assange told Hannity. What do you think? Scroll down to comment below. This has been the Trump Breaking News Network. Please subscribe and share to stay up to date on the latest news about our president. Be informed.